Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some Pokemon Silver. We're gonna go climb up a burnt tower. Um, so yeah, this is Daily Nuzlocke. I do these daily until either I lose or I beat the game, whichever happens first. If you want to keep helping me spread the love, support, leave a like, stuff like that is always helpful for me. Helpful for my channel, but also helpful for morale, because I get to see... Oh, I can catch a Pokemon in here. Oh my god. No, oh, it's a that. So who cares? I mean, um, because I already have Jake, that is. Let me be clear on that one. I'm gonna use this time to actually level, try and level up Nux a bit as we... I potentially climb up. I don't know if I have Rock Smash or not, but... If I do, then, um... It'll help us out in here. But yeah, remember, leave a like, comment on some of your stuff. And it turns out, I can't even climb here because I don't have to Rock Smash. So I have to come back for Rock Smash. Aw, oh, damn it. Alright, let's get out of here. Can I fall down to the second floor? A coughing? Okay. Uh, let's hit him with a tackle. It's another Pokemon for potential. Oh, why do you have to be such a... Now he's poisoned. You know now that... Oh, he's not poisoned. Why did that take 27 years to finish the animation? Why is this move so long if it's not guaranteed poison? It does so little. It's actually kind of funny how little it does. And that's a one, dos, tres. Two, three. Yeah. Coughing was caught. Coughing. So, it's another Pokemon for the reserves. The few, the proud, reserves. Yeah, it's a big old gas ball, so let's give a nickname, huh? Oh, it's even sludge up there. Let's see. Who's on the list here? Um, all right, this is going to be named after you, Gavin, Gavin, perfect, who's calling me, Todd Camper, it's me Todd, got a minute, how are your Pokemon doing, my Celtic's really energetic, hey listen, I almost caught a rat the other day. So close. See you later. Bye, Todd. Yeah, you totally can fall. Oh, there's Suicune and Entei and uh, Raiko. Not to be confused with Fake Grand Order's Raiko, the giant titty woman. Now that would be something if she was up there, though. I would gladly find Rock Smash to find that woman. Sure as hell, no uh, sure as hell knows that it, uh, she doesn't respond to quartz from my summonings. Has anyone done fan art of Raikou dressed up as Raikou? Also, did anyone realize until I just said this that Raikou and Raikou are based off the same mythological figure? Because everyone knows Mama Raikou from Fate Grand Orders based off of Minamoto Raikou? No, Minamoto no Raikou, who is the male hero from Japan myth and um, made female because why not, I guess. Which is the the basic antithesis, basic thesis of all fake Grand Order gender benders, except for a Selfo, who is just a dude, a very pretty dude. Nothing wrong with that, of course. Is what I'm trying to say here. I respect all. And Dion, who is, I believe, the actual myth uh, mythological historical figure for Dion was actually um, born male and female it was I, I remember looking it up because i was always interested was it like actually dion hiding their gender and it turned out like it was actually both he was dion was born both so that's why you got that and i was like oh that's cool i'm sure i'm not sure how they would like the idea of i think dion's character is handled very respectfully <laughs> compared to a lot of other characters in fate it has occasional fan service of course but there's nothing wrong with Loving a character. It's always done in a loving way is what I'm trying to say. Uh, and I forgot to remove the whooper. So... There we go. <laughs> doom, 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 doom. Thank you for waiting. <sighs> yeah, Raikou. Man, I want a Raikou in my fate. It'd be nice. Giant... 
boobied woman. I do realize that there is, I believe, a little girl watching this. But it's okay. I think. I'm not gonna censor myself. Just know that I have a very particular set of tastes. Something that you don't have to learn until you're much older. Don't worry about it. Also, there is no kids watching this. YouTube, don't try and sue me, please. Okay, let's see. What is that? What the hell is a Team Aqua Grunt doing up there? So we need someone... I'm almost positive he has fighting types. So I'm gonna put up Nightmare and see if I'm right. And if I'm wrong, then I'll just switch out Nightmare to someone else. I mean overseas, yarr. So he either has water types or fighting types. Take a wild swing. See ya? It's a sailor. Sailor Harry sent out Whooper. Okay. His Whooper's strong, too. Ooh, nightmare. Hypnosis! And now, while it's sleeping, Flash! Oh god, that was not a... So I'm just gonna keep on flashing the sleeping Whooper in the face until it can't hit me with any of its moves. Yes. I like the idea of the Whooper being fully awake and getting flashed in the eye. It's just <laughs> not... <laughs> it's like, oh no, he's fast asleep, don't worry about it. He's not gonna be able to hit for shit when he wakes up, but... Pound. Okay. This Whooper's just gonna take a, a deep nap. Honestly, same. I feel it. Really, Nightmare? That was your critical hit? I mean, I shouldn't be complaining, because you are being, in essence, carried by your hypnosis ability. Oh, no. Wow! Okay. Want to talk about a weird flex, it's the fact that that whooper was flashed three times, used the lowest hitting move possible, and fucking got me. Alright, Nightmare, let's keep at it. There's a chance for you to die here if he wakes up and hits you with another slam. But that's a risk I'm willing to take, to not waste- mm. No. I'll use a potion. I don't want your blood on my hands, Nightmare. This poor Whooper. This is literally Whooper's worst nightmare. Pound. What is with this freaking- Now, you know what? I don't blame you. Because I also have a Whooper, and let me tell you, until it learned Surf, it also did not have any good moves. Let me see how much this water gun does. Yeah! See? What the fuck? <laughs> it's a pittance. I didn't even level up from that. Screw you, Sailor Harry. Go to hell. Suck on some donuts. I almost battled that woman. I mean, Nux legitimately needs to learn some moves for... No, someone needs to be trained up. I think it needs to be... Oh, Wong was in our team, not... Um... Oh, you know what? It needs to be Wong, because I need to get his friendship up. And if the next gym is fighting type like I think, then he needs to love us more. Flaffy! That's Sahal. But we have no Sahal yet. Oops, wrong move. I was thinking that was Sand Attack. It was not Sand Attack. Hopefully this does not one-shot kill me. I ended up getting saved. <laughs> Tackle fight. Jesus Christ, Wong. Okay. Come on, Wong. You got this, buddy. I believe in you. I believe in your ability to fuck up Flaffy. Zahal, that is. Well, not Zahal. He's not Zahal unless we have him. Otherwise, he's just a random-ass Pokemon we're fighting. Hello, Psyduck. What are the chances of this Psyduck knowing confusion and actually being able to hurt Wong? <gasps> okay, so here's what's gonna happen. Is that I'm gonna use Tail Whip until that, until that disable is gone. How about that? Hmm? No? Okay. <sighs> Tackle. 
and hope the sable misses again. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Sure, CPU. Sure. You just knew exactly the perfect timing, huh? Son of a bitch, I hate fucking the CPU. Such a bullshit con artist. No. Please, no, for the love of God. Okay. Potion. There it is. 20 HP. I mean, thankfully, this side deck is actually very weak as shit, so. Growl. I can't believe I'm still fucking disabled. Can you stop? Ugh. Can you stop being disabled, Wong? Can you stop, please? Before you also get confused from this dumbass duck who won't stop hating you. Oh, you know what I should do? I should do Sand Attack. That's what I'm switching to next because he's clearly just only using Confusion now. Is this the world's longest disable? I should be undisabled by now. Don't you try and use Tail Whip on me, you fucking bastard of a duck. Okay. Oh, you're trying to lower my defense, huh? Well, good luck fucking hitting me. Yeah, that's what I freaking thought. Can Wong stop being disabled? Oh my god. It's literally hurting you now. Because there's like... Thank you! Okay. Next turn I'm gonna fucking destroy this Doug. I cannot believe you were disabled for that long, long. Die, Duck. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Lena Dana? Last Anna. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Get out of my face. Who's next? This guy. Let me try something I learned today. I learned how to tie my shoes. Anything? I keep thinking he has a giant diaper. He does not have a giant diaper. Mr. Mime. I mean... Mmm, that's bad. That's very bad. That's very bad. So, I'm going to someone who I know for a fact can take a psychic hit. Go Nightmare. Yep. Yep, that's what I thought. I should've used the Sable. But it's fine. Can I still use the sable? Hmm, apparently not. Alright, let's get you healed up a bit. My good old nightmare. Okay, let's see now. I guess we're just gonna pound him, because he's Mr. Mime. He doesn't have that much defense. Slap. Yeah, I was right. Uh-oh. Okay, so on my turn, disable. Pound. I mean, he's just gonna make... It's the CPU. He knows exactly what... Okay, no, he's not. I'm almost positive from this one experience that means that confusion is the only- What do you mean it failed? Please don't crit. There we go. Okay, for some reason Disables decided to not work. Maybe it doesn't work on psychic types or something. Why is there so many psychic Pokemon in this, this route today? Don't make no sense. 
Yeah, go to sleep, you son of a bitch. This wouldn't have been a problem if it, if, if it was not for the fact that you did you use meditate. And of course. Thank God Nightmare can take a hit. And guess who knows hypnosis. I need you to not get crit here, buddy. Okay. So now... Okay, that's the last of my potions, so I have to actually legitimately go... <laughs> Gain your man, can't miss the use Jedi mind tricks on Gengar so I didn't use Shadow Ball! <laughs> funny because it's true. Alright. Wong's at level. Alright, Nightmare leveled up somehow. <laughs> Alright, good job, Nightmare. Turned out keeping you around was a good job. I didn't study enough, I guess. You didn't study these nuts. Boy. Alright, we're leaving. Gonna go get our boys healed up. Did I catch the Pokemon here? No, I totally didn't. So, let's actually catch a Pokemon before we leave here. It's a mouth! Okay, so... Oh shit. Okay, thank god. What? Go to hell, Meowth. This actually works for me because I want to get lower in attack so I don't instantly one-shot you. I keep thinking Bite's gonna just completely wreck my day, but I'm thinking in the concept of it hurts Kit Fisto, and that's about it. Okay. Time to use a Pokeball. No. What time is, is to switch out to Kit Fisto. Yep. Good move. And now, I will throw a Pokeball. Do -do -do -do. So let's see, who can beat me out? Scratch Cat. Yeah, let's see. Let's see who we got here. This is the perfect name. It will be... Our Meowth, who joins the reserve, the few, the willing, the strong. Ya boy. Trash. Trash. There we go. Ya boy Trash. Now you join the reserves with all the other fantastic Pokemon waiting in, waiting in the wings in case anyone takes a die where everyone's currently living. Uh-huh. You can heal Pokemon. Basically, they're all in there guarding Skoo, who Skoo is in there until uh, further notice, until we can actually train up Skoo. Thank you for waiting. Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. All right, everyone, that's the end of today's episode. I hope you liked it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment about how stuff is going on, how you feeling. As you saw with... Um, K Nerd Man, I really do read all of them and I really do enjoy them. So until next time, everyone, have a good day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.